in this lesson we will discussing about the region and the zone uh, which are be in which the google cloud platform is being hosted so here we can use this and uh, in many of the region the the uh, the Google Cloud uh, platform GCP is being hosted and it is being hosted in North Virginia, Virginia. It is being hosted in Los Angeles. It is being hosted in Mumbai. It is being hosted for Netherlands, Finland, London, Sydney, and so on. So, so you can have an understanding that in all the region, it is being hosted. For example, at a country where here the users from this country can host Sydney, uh, can host their payload at Sydney, and at here it, it a country is being available here so it has the option to host at Sydney and in Singapore so what does it mean that I can host from here I can host Finland also okay or from here I can use uh, uh, Tokyo also but this when we are having a Tokyo so it will be uh, the, the, the thing is that it will take some time to retrieve some data it, it, it will be fast but it, it will be compared if we compare with Sydney and Tokyo Sydney will be have a take a lead because it is nearer to that location where we are currently in so uh, you can see that we can have in Mumbai so from Pakistan we can host our data on Mumbai so, so, so uh, for we can host our data on Singapore we can host our data on uh, Mumbai and, and the Singapore are being easily uh, available here so you can see that that and every region they had been deployed uh, and the Google GCP services are being deployed and they are introducing they are launching some new regions uh, so that they can uh, they can be available at 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 overall level they can be available in an every country or in every region so here this is the uh, map of google gcp region and now let's have this that global resource or multi-regional resource so a big qd data store cloud storage are those resources which are being used uh, for from uh, it it is being hosted over different different regions and all the global resources uh, because it is being hosted on at all the levels so here we can say that that at taiwan or at at Sydney, Sydney has uh, for example 200 sources, 200 services but Taiwan has only 100 services we can say that but uh, here we can say that the global resource or multi-regional resource are those which are being allocated at overall uh, re regions in the Google Cloud so be it from BigQuery, Data Store, Cloud Storage it has been hosted on in every region or in the multiple region then we have regional source app engine instance service is being uh, installed or is being uh, hosted and is being looked allocated at the app in uh, regional uh, resources at when we go towards the zonal resources we have the VM instance that it, this VM has this number of uh, the of RAM this number of uh, computation power and so on so forth so his, this is the GCP region on its own and now it is so much popular GCP which it is exploring new regions it is exploring new countries so that they can host they can they can be a world leader in all the parts of the world which will which will benefit them in terms of their sales, in terms of their cloud rel reliability and so on and so forth. So, so this is the overall introduction of the GCP region and the Google Cloud uh, Compute uh, Go GCP platform which it, and I will request you to please go through this, search the web so that you can have a better understanding.